Alexander Stein. Hello, my name is Alexander Stein and I'm calling from Highland Park and the reason I'm here today is we need to take a page, Mayor Johnson, out of New York's book and we got to mandate vaccines because right now I am losing housekeepers left and right because listen, every time the service sends a housekeeper to my house and they test positive for coronavirus, I can't have them work around my kids. I have two trans kids in my house, both on puberty blockers and you realize they are vulnerable, they're immunocompromised. We need more people vaccinated. We're, I'm, I voted for Joe Biden, so I'm happy that we're getting more migration to Dallas. But until we mandate these vaccines, we're going to continue to get people sick. We have to get creative. In New York, they're giving $100 plus a free hamburger. Here in Dallas, maybe in the urban centers, we give free KFC. We give uh, free tacos in the Latin markets because the Latin markets, I'm telling you, I've had multiple housekeepers die from the Delta variant. And that is so hard on my children, Deca and Daleks, because what, what a nine-year-old, when they lose their favorite housekeeper and they lose that pupusa recipe, when the service sends the next worker, uh, that housekeeper doesn't make the same recipe. So my kids are going through a, a, just a total turmoil. So we have to get creative. And we have to go into the gay community, like a creative idea. Um, since you're the first openly gay mayor of Dallas, we ought to do Mayor Johnson's free Johnson & Johnson because the gay community would like the double entendre. And then we could also do like a, a drag queen story time where we could have, you know, free vaccines. We could have drag queens reading to children. And then we could just have this, you know, open air market of, of, of you know, cleanliness and not a bunch of people with germs because what have, what's happening now is we have Governor Abbott who is, is going to make it that everybody's going to get sick and die of Delta unless we get these vaccines and my vaccine won't work unless you are vaccinated. So we need to stick needles in arms. We need vaccine mandates. You shouldn't be able to shop. You shouldn't be able to work and you shouldn't be able to go to any of these sports games, especially Texas high school football without your vaccination. And we need you uh, being a gay icon like yourself in the gay community. We need you, Mayor Johnson, to offer this because we cannot protect these people without the vaccine not enough people are getting it and now everybody that doesn't have the vaccine is making me sick i don't deserve to be sick i follow the rules i'm doing everything right and until you make vaccines mandatory i'm going to keep on losing housekeepers left and right and i just can't do that because that is so hard on my family it's not fair to my family so until vaccines are mandated we're going to keep on having people get sick we're going to keep on having people die and i'm telling you i can't i can get it it's easier to get my nine and 11 year old on puberty blockers than it is to give them a COVID-19 vaccine. We have to make it okay for five-year-olds to 12-year-olds to get vaccinated. We need more vaccines now. Vaccines are the way out of this. And until you make it so we can't live in this society without a, a vaccine, you're going to have all these people with their fake vaccine cards and their anti-maskers like Governor Abbott ruining everything for us. And let me tell you something. I'm not going to stand here and just let everybody live their life while I got my vaccine. And I was sick for two weeks after my vaccine. And I did it because that is for the greater good and and sadly we have a bunch of people that aren't willing to mandate these vaccines so we have a bunch of cheaters so please mayor johnson and johnson's free johnson and johnson what time is you up? Do it in cedar springs thank you karen hughes